I've been thinking about an image uh, that uh, <coughs> is uh, I think the Tibetan uh, teachers use it and uh, in terms of how we you know, uh, approach the mind, work with the mind, whether in meditation or or not, but just how we relate to the to the mind images is uh, um, whether one relates to it the objects of the mind or the what comes up in the mind like a like a dog or like a lion so when you uh, throw a stick for a say like a dog and a dog will go and chase the stick and it'll bring it back you know, and it'll be happy to chase that stick for however long and you throw out a stick for a lion and the lion doesn't even look at the stick it goes and chases after the person who throws the stick <laughs> and, <laughs> and and that's how we have to relate to you in terms of relating to our mind. Um, we have to learn how to relate to the mind like a lion rather than a dog. Because we're uh, that endless chasing after moods, chasing after thoughts. Um, <clears throat> it's a, uh, uh, you, know, you know, on a good day, you know, we can be like a, a golden lab who's who's sort of kind of boundless energy and and uh, sort of tail wagging and happy to chase however many sticks you throw but uh, um, you know you still as they say you get tired and, and, uh, and in the end you don't really there is no resolution uh, so that uh, that with a line, you've got to uh, relating to it like that. You've got to when there's thoughts, you have to come back and and uh, come back to the mind itself, come back to the to the source, and uh, learn how to resolve those 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 thoughts, those moods, those obsessions, those fears, and and uh, learn how to resolve them rather than uh, chasing after them and. And either, you know, either proliferating about them and creating stories around them, or analyzing them uh, sort of over and over and over again, and so that uh, you know, there's so much self-involved. But that uh, just yeah, learning to come back and and uh, resolve those those moods of the mind, see them. For what they are, and not get, not get entangled, not get trapped, and not spend one's time just running after them all the time.